Hey guys, Yvdo here, and today I'll be showing you how to find ancient cities in the Minecraft 1.19 Wild Update for both Java and Bedrock Edition. Ancient cities are incredibly rare structures, which are not only difficult to find, but also very dangerous to visit. So you should only really go looking for these if you're an experienced player, with good weapons and armour. Despite the risks, ancient cities are still well worth visiting as they're the only places you can find echo shards to make a recovery compass, and also the only place you can find disc fragments to craft the number 5 music disc. There are plenty of other great items to find as well, including the new swift sneak enchantment, diamond horse armour, skeleton skulls, the other side music disc, and much more. Your first step to finding one then, should be making sure you have the necessary gear to survive the trip else you won't live long enough to get any of those items home. Besides the more obvious things, like a good bow, sword and armour, other useful items to bring include milk buckets to alleviate the warden's darkness effect, night vision potions for finding your way around, and totems of undying, allowing you to survive a hit from the warden. Now that you're geared up, where are ancient cities found most often? While they can appear below any overworld biome, there are some that they appear under more often, namely the new mountain biomes, including meadows, grooves, snowy peaks, jagged peaks, and stony peaks. Annoyingly, this does mean you'll need to dig through more blocks to get down to the level you'll find the cities at, but it is still worth it for the increased spawn rate. Speaking of which, the level you'll find ancient cities at is Y-52, you should be careful, however, as Y-52 refers to the floor level of the cities, and doesn't consider the space above. The cities are found at the bottom of large caves in a deep dark biome. This means that if you were to dig straight down, you'll almost certainly fall into the cave well before Y-52. In which case, as a way of avoiding this, once you get down to around Y-10, you should start strip mining and explore any cave you find, especially if it's a deep dark biome. This is much safer, as you'll likely come across the cave entrance from the side rather than from above. If you're not finding any at this height, try going a bit lower, but make sure to mine down carefully, either in a staircase fashion or by straddling two blocks. Don't get discouraged if it takes you a while to find one. While these tips will help, they aren't a guarantee. Due to the rarity of ancient cities, there is a degree of luck involved in finding them. If you're patient enough, however, and you follow the tips I've given you, then you will eventually find one, and should survive the visit. If you are really struggling to find an ancient city, and don't mind cheating a little, there is one thing you can do that will guarantee finding one, and in no time at all, and that is by using the slash locate command. The command is actually written slightly differently on Java and Bedrock Edition, but achieves the same goal. Using this command will require you to enable cheats. This does mean that achievements will be voided on Bedrock Edition for that world, so it's up to you if you want to use this. You can enable cheats on Bedrock by pausing the game, click Settings, Game, and then scroll down to Activate Cheats. Make sure you have coordinates on as well. Now open the chat and type in slash locate ancient city. Note that the command has to be entered exactly as you see on screen. It is case sensitive and if entered incorrectly it will not work. Once you do enter it correctly you'll be provided with the coordinates of the nearest ancient city so you'll know exactly where to look. For Java players you can enable cheats by pausing the game, click open to LAN, Enable cheats and then start the LAN party. Unlike on Bedrock, you'll still be able to earn achievements, even after using cheats. Now open a chat and type in slash locate structure minecraft colon ancient underscore city. To ensure you enter it correctly, consider copying the command from the description, as if you enter it wrong, it won't work. All you need to do is mine towards it in order to find it. If you're playing on a creative world, and just want to find a city to look around, once you enter the command, you can actually click on the coordinates to teleport to them. If you find yourself stuck in blocks, 
After doing so, just go into spectator mode. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have, you may also enjoy watching my video all about the Warden, Ancient Cities and the Deep Dark Biome next. For more Minecraft tutorials like this one, do consider subscribing and thanks for watching. Thank you.